so today I have got another wish haul. So I did one of these not too long ago and it has like blown up. By blown up I mean it's done really well for me. It's not exactly gone viral. But it's now got over like 10,000 views which is absolutely mad. When I uploaded the video, sorry I'm fiddling with my leggings. <laughs> when I originally uploaded the video I didn't realise that it was that much of a video that could go big for me. I sound really big headed but I'm not. What I mean is it's the most views I've ever got on a video and it has kind of caused me to hit 400 subscribers. Oh yeah. Oh my shoulder really hurts. I've been off school for the past couple of days because it's been really bad. Oh my god there's a fly. And it's so annoying that I've been off because my shoulder had like a trapped nerve, been aching. It's gone bad again. And the days I was off school, it's so nice out, so I've been stuck in bed. I'm currently sweating, so if you hear noise, it's because my window's open because I've got a studio light on me. Studio light, softbox light, a big old light facing me. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like my hair, like that little bump there is really annoying. <laughs> Had it cut this morning, so it's quite a lot shorter than it was because it was all dead. I'm st going to stop rambling. <laughs> but anyway... After I initially uploaded that video, I wanted to do another one anyway, but when I saw how many views it got, I was like, okay, I have to do another one. Plus, I've had several requests in the comments to do another one. So that's what I'm doing today. And I'm so annoyed at myself and my impatience because, right, I need to burp, hang on. So I actually filmed this already yesterday, but because I was in a lot of pain, like it's gotten a lot better today, but I've just got to not jiggle it around so much because I don't want to jar it again. Anyway. I filmed the video while I was at home because mum was like, you're not just sitting in bed, do something. So I was like, okay, I'll film a video. Plus, I just wanted to open the Wish packages because I had stopped myself until yesterday. I was like, you know what, I'm going to not open them until I film the video. And I watched the video back today, I started editing and I was like, I hate this. I was not myself, I was so quiet, I was in pain. So now I've just got all the packages open when I could have been closed if I'd have just waited a day. Yay. One of my packages also hasn't come yet, but I was too impatient to wait any longer, so I'll just have to include that in the next one, because I will probably do another one. Anyway, I'm going to stop blabbing on, and let's just get on to the video. Let's ignore the fact that my plant is dying. I need to water it again today. I'm so sad that I can't look after my plant. So the first thing that I opened yesterday was a laptop sticker. This is what it looked like on the picture. I'm going to get it up on my phone right now. Yes, this is currently £2, apparently down from £6, which I can see. This is what it looks like. I really, really like this. It's an ap apple juice carton thing. And it did come with a protective, like, clear overlay thing. And I think I did put it on wrong. But... I'm going so yellow. Hello? Lighting fix, please. What are you doing? doing the video. Yes. Say hello. Me? I can't remember where I was now. Oh yeah, it came with this like clear plastic overlay thing. But when I put it on, you could see like the borders. Whereas this, it looks like it's on there. And I really like it. And... The shape was quite hard to stick on, it was a bit flimsy, but I mean, I think I got it pretty spot. I mean, it's a bit wonky, but you know, what can you do? I really like this, and I definitely think it's worth the £2 that I paid, because, I mean, it's, it was only £2, and it looks really good, and it looks really cute. I'm sorry, I can't get over how cute this looks. <laughs> but anyway, I would rate that a 9.5 out of 10, the only reason I've deducted a 0.5 this curtain's really going to annoy me. The only reason I deducted a 0.5 is because oh well, the reason I'm deducting a 0.5 of a point is just because I don't know how long this is going to last without the protective layer. But I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. The next one was also a success and I was so shocked when I saw this packaging. So I ordered a pop socket and this is what the looks like. I think this was the one I couldn't open. And the app is frozen. Yeah, it doesn't let me on it, so I, this is the best I can show you for a photo. I am guessing it was £2, £42, but this is the packaging it came with. How professional does that look? 
Okay, and this is Amy's room. Go and check out her channel, because she's recording. I can't remember where I was now. I literally can't remember where I was. I know I was talking about the packaging, but for something that's come off of Wish, and if you watched my last Wish haul, you will see my little like selfie camera light thing that I got. Came in some like Chinese Japanese packaging and it looks so bad. The product was really good, but the packaging was all dented and it wasn't very good. But this, sorry, I just the car. This looks literally looks like something you've bought out of like a shop. Pop me, grip me, prop me. And this is the colour of the one that I got. It's just rainbow. It like pulls out really well. It's sticking really well because I've got like a slidey. But I am very impressed with this. I was very impressed with this when I first opened it. And this is definitely a 10 out of 10. I don't see how you could get like it's a pop socket. What could go wrong? So this next one I was so disappointed with. I really wanted it to work, but it just didn't. So I saw this picture and it says it is a mini karaoke, karaoke like microphone for phone, that sort of thing. And this is what it looks like. It is really cute. This is like what it looks like there. It is like wire. It's not plastic. This is actually sturdy. Like how do I? Like that. But I plugged it into my iPad and like it's got a bit for headphones so you can hear what it's saying. It just didn't work. Like I'll insert a clip of me here trying to get it to work. Should we see if that worked? No sound is coming out. Do I have to turn it on? Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, I think I may have broken it. Not that it works in the first place. I don't understand how you make this work. Oh, you plug headphones into the other thing. Okay, let's see if it works now. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing's working. They don't work. I think I'm doing something wrong. Everyone says it's work. It works. What am I doing? No, I can't get it to work. It's a flop. It's a flop. I might just be doing it wrong, but this mini microphone for me does not work. So, I mean, looks wise, I would give it like, it looks like a nine, eight out of 10, but because it doesn't work, I'm gonna have to give it two. I'm giving it two just because it's such a cool idea and it looks really cool. And maybe I just got one that didn't work, plus I did kind of take the top off and nearly break it or maybe did break it but I was trying to get it to work and it just didn't work so sad oh and this oh it's changed since yesterday yesterday this was two pound and today it is a pound down from 11 pounds see if this was really 11 pounds I would be sending it straight back and complaining because it doesn't work it just doesn't work I'm sorry next is a jewelry item oh, uh, and it came in this little plastic pot and it is a nose ring. I'm not gonna put it in because it's so thin and I'm scared it's gonna get my nose infected. I put it in yesterday and I didn't like it. It just doesn't sit right in your nose. Actually, I'm gonna have to put it in an eye. <laughs> uh, it's a cute idea. It's meant to have this little flower at the side there to go along with the hoop. First off, I'm not used to wearing a hoop, so. That probably doesn't help. I'm used to wearing a stud. <laughs> But the positioning of the flower, to me, just... Like, I think the flower's meant to sit like that, like flat on the nose, but it just doesn't. Might just be my nose shape or where I got my piercing, but it just doesn't sit right and it feels like it's going to break, so I'm just going to give it a no. <laughs> but uh, I just think I'm a stud kind of girl. I think I need to get a hoop that's not from Wish. <laughs> It just feels cheap, it looks cheap, sounds cheap. I'm going to give this. What should I give it so that? Well, I think a one, because the idea again was cute, but it really did not come across very well. Oh I've... <laughs> the next thing is another piece of jewellery and it's a necklace, but really annoyingly. The charm comes separate from the necklace and the charm is one of those charms that can fall off which I really don't like 
because it can fall off so easily. I actually didn't tell you the price and show you the picture of the last item. Oops, this is what it looks like on the picture. And it's now currently £1, but again, yesterday it was £2, so the price can change all the time on Wish. But like as you can see from the picture, it it's like the flower's meant to be flat and it's not flat on that like plastic. It's just so this is a necklace. I will show you it up close. It's a little apple charm, which I think is so cute. It reminds me of like Snow White or something like that. Oh, the charm nearly came off. That is just one really annoying thing about it. I hate when necklaces have charms that can come off because I am like so clumsy, it would definitely come off. But this feels like solid. I really like this. This does not feel cheap. It doesn't feel like high quality or high end, but it doesn't feel like the nose ring does, which is I think this will look really cute. I'm not going to put it on now because I've already got two necklaces on and I think that will be a bit much. But I really like this. I can definitely see myself wearing this. This is what it looks like in the picture. It definitely looks like the picture. Like, you can't really complain. The apple looks exactly the same and the chain looks exactly the same. So, you're getting what you get in the picture and for quality wise, you're getting what you pay for. But I think it's... I think this is worth more than £2. I mean, I haven't tried the clasp yet. I don't know whether it'll break really easily. It is quite hard to do, but that's because I don't have any nails. But honestly, I this is something that you could buy. Like, this is better than Primark quality, I'd say. Just because I really, I'm not a big fan of Primark jewellery. I like the necklace. I'm going to give that an 8 out of 10. You know what? I think I'm going to do... <laughs> I think I'm going to do the bad one now, just because I don't want it to end on a low. So... If you watch my last wish video, you will see I bought a wig. It was a silver grey wig. It had sh it was straight, had a weird fringe, really bad roots. But if you shoved a hat on and a filter, you could make it look like half decent. Not amazing, but it didn't look as bad as it did in person. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna try a different different colour wig. <sighs> different style of wig. Um regret <laughs> this looks nothing like the photo this was i think originally 10 pounds but i might have been able to get it for eight because i like scrolled through different pages but it, this is at the moment 10 pounds down from 92 there is no way on earth this is worth 92 pounds it literally looks like it's come from a halloween shop Honestly, this is so bad. The other one was cheaper than this, and this is worse. This didn't come with the cap thing that the other one did. Um, like the thing to keep my hair out of my face. This is what the picture looks like. And this is what the actual hair looks like. The colour is completely wrong. Like even if you scroll through, the colour this is the this is the picture that they give for this colour. And this colour looks like bubblegum neon pink whereas that's more pastel pink and the roots look like they fade more and they're brown and it just looks a lot softer and nicer and this just doesn't i'm gonna put it on so there is no way you can make this look natural <laughs> it is so itchy no i feel like stephanie at lazy town like major stephanie vibes out of lazy town I feel like I could just start breaking out into song at any moment. It makes the roots go. <laughs> Still does not look natural at all. Bing bang ding we get all funny words to sing when I am dancing, dancing. So see if I can get a decent selfie out of this. Yeah, still looks horrific. I'm sweating. Let's get it off now. So I'm 100% giving this a 0 out of 10. Because, I mean, it's good for a costume. But... It doesn't look like the photo at all. <laughs> so you would have just seen me actually wearing a hat with that wig. And that hat is also from this wish haul. 
it's white and it says youth on it and this is a picture it looks exactly like the picture which I'm very happy about unlike some items I think me throwing it around is making it a lot worse but you know what who cares this is what the picture looks like it's currently two pounds and I feel like I did pay two pounds for it and it's got this sort of back which is one thing I definitely don't like about it I mean it's got a popper back but at least it's adjustable which is I thought he got again which is a plus I can definitely see myself wearing this I mean I feel like a cheesy 12 year old but I am a cheesy 18 year old <laughs> and I mean for a sunny day like today this would definitely come in handy for two pounds I think this is a solid oh my gosh my hair for two pounds this is definitely like a nine out of ten the only reason I'm deducting a point is because of this ridiculous plastic popper back just make a material one I mean if it had that it probably might be oh voila so second to last item of course I had to buy a pair of glasses from which I bought two in the last haul and one of them I really love the sunglasses not so much but the normal glasses I quite like so I got another pair of sunglasses <laughs> I like these, and I didn't think I liked the shape, but I actually do. And because I've got quite a big head, these glasses make my head smaller. Smaller, look smaller, they don't actually shrink my head. Imagine if you had like glasses that could literally shrink my head. I would buy some of those because I mean, I don't want my big head. But they are these like gold. I think they were meant to be rose gold. I don't know what colour I bought, but I am pretty sure I didn't buy the gold ones. Ugh. That is one of my biggest makeup hates is like when my lip lip lips or look her at create a line. Gross. So these were two pounds, down from apparently 26. Uh the quality, no, definitely not worth 26 pounds. But in the photo these did look more rose goldy pink. Although there are some photos where they look gold, so I mean I'm not complaining. They are a similar colour. The lenses are blue, <laughs> like you can see they are pure blue, so they would not protect from the sun, they just turn the world a different colour. <laughs> but I mean, for an Instagram picture, these are alright, I rate them. And I feel like to, oh my neck, I feel like if you're just like accessorising an outfit and you don't think you're actually going to wear them and you just want them like on your head, again, a solid, they fit on my head. They feel, they do feel solid, they don't feel like plastic and, well they do feel plastic, they don't feel flimsy, like they don't feel like they're going to break if I bend them, which is good. So I give these a 7 or an 8 out of 10, I just don't like how the lenses are blue, they could have just done them black. And then the final thing, I thought this was what my mystery package, because of the way they were packaged, um, on the picture, this is what it is, it's some beauty blenders. They looked like they were going to come in a little pot. So I was a bit confused when I got a flat package and I was like, okay, this must be what the mystery box item is. But no. I thought that was a doorbell. I felt it and it felt really squishy. I was like, this has to be the sponges. Oh, there's a hair. It is the sponges. They come in two little packs. You could have either bought a pack of five or a pack of ten. I honestly, for some reason, thought it was going to be two different. I thought it was going to be ten different ones not two of the same pack but I mean I was pretty dumb for thinking that because in the photo it literally shows two of the same so I mean that was me being dumb but it comes with two funny little peanut shaped ones and it comes with three eggs Ooh. and this one is bigger than the other because this is what it looks like when it has been dampened I mean it's not proper damp it probably could be a bit bigger than this because I dampened it yesterday but I used it today for my concealer and I mean oh I didn't actually wipe away my bake I've just realized <laughs> and for blending concealer under my eyes I didn't like it because I felt like it picked up half the product I'm definitely I definitely didn't like it I put more on top and then used a brush although I did use the collection last time perfection concealer instead of the LA girl pro conceal which is the one that I usually use, so maybe I need to try it with my everyday concealer. But I used it to um, blend in the concealer on my eyelids and I loved it, it worked so well. And then I used this little green one to like bake my under eyes and I really liked it. So for, how much I paid? Two pounds. Again, 
I do love it when my camera overheats. Really fun. I can't remember what I was saying. Like, literally no idea what I was saying. So, to sponges, for two pounds, for 10 sponges, like mini micro sponges, I think, oh, I don't think that's too bad. You probably could have only done with five. You really don't need 10 unless you're like a makeup artist that like needs them. So no. Oh my God. What? What? <sighs> I'm so confused. Good resistance to sexual oil can make the product durable. <laughs> what? I don't think that's what I think it means, but I need to get that right. <laughs> that's, no. I mean, it does have Japanese slash Chinese on the front. I'm sorry if I'm offending anyone when I say Japanese or Chinese. I just genuinely don't know the difference between like the writing. I hear a dog at the door. Come on in. I just got pie. Come on, come here. Bitch. For two pounds, seven, six out of 10, just because I didn't like how it blended. And they don't exactly go to the size that they look like. That might just be me overestimating because I tend to do that. Um, but for the price and size, I think they're quite reasonable. So that's everything. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video I have a hair. There might be a little bit of a lull in videos this past, this past, this next month of May because I have A levels at the end of May. But after that, I will be finished until September when I hopefully go to university. So I will have three months of solid video making and I was planning them out the other day. If you follow my Instagram, name's here. My ne The name is also at the end on the end card. I post on my story quite a lot there and I posted like a little message saying basically all what I'm saying now about how I'm gonna have to like post once a week until summer and then I can go back to twice a week or maybe even more. I'm so excited, I've got all these videos planned, big ups, and this weather is just making it all so much better. Filming this video really hurt my neck and shoulder. I tried to just move around and ignore the pain, but the pain was there. Solid there. So anyway, I'm going to go and enjoy the sun. I'm gonna go chill in the garden because I don't need to be stuck in my bed. I can just go and lay on the grass or something. And I'm gonna end the video. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.